guys, this is Fiendbrain91, and I'm talking about Modern Warfare 2. Why? Not specifically about the game, but a Call of Duty player, this person was actually banned from Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 after buying two different games. Yep, got banned apparently the first time, and then the second time got banned again, okay? So, this person decided since and let me explain this from my own personal experience if you guys have watched my video before because i was banned from modern warfare i still don't know the reason why i don't use any like cheating software or anything i only play on xbox even so it's not even like that excuse that unless i mean i don't know but activision doesn't really tell you a specific reason why you're banned they just use like generic talking points and you're not allowed to contact there's no back and forth with activision like with certain other companies so this person decided to actually go to the Activision office in Austin, Texas. I guess the person lived nearby, I'm not sure. And talk, but they couldn't get in the building. The security guard wouldn't let them in. They asked the security guard to pass off a message and the security guard agreed to do so. But apparently they're short staffed, like that's weird to me, but apparently they're short staffed. So basically they're like, they're not gonna be able to immediately fix this problem. And then like the person was frustrated and stuff like that, but it seems like this person did not get too angry here or something like that, so that's good, right? But here's the thing, Activision Blizzard, their customer service is just bad because when you get banned, you're not told a specific reason and you're making an appeal and then like you don't even know what happens behind the scenes because then you get a very generic like response if they decide, no, you're gonna stay banned. Like you get a very generic response and I actually do not blame this person for going down there because when you don't even have a customer service like Line, you can't even call a customer service representative at Activision. But I am going to say this. Listen, guys. I understand it can be frustrating because it does seem, I've watched some YouTube videos, and it does seem like uh, wrongful banning is happening. And Activision Blizzard doesn't seem to care too much about it. But I will say this. God willing, Microsoft w may take over Modern Warfare 2. God willing. I don't know. God only knows. But I'm hoping if and when they do, because Microsoft, from my personal experience, has really good customer service. I'm hoping they will take over the customer support when they, if and when they take over Activision. Because Microsoft has very good customer service, support, or service, whatever you call it, when, at least from my experience. So I'm really hoping they take it over. So while I'm saying this, like guys, if you get banned wrongfully, definitely do all the stuff you can. God willing, you will get your account back and stuff like that. But maybe since they are getting taken over, God, once again, God willing, like I think next year sometime, we, it may be best not to freak out too much about this because listen, if I get my offer too, God willing, hopefully I won't be banned. If I am banned, you know, I'll, and even if I'm not banned, I'll, listen, if people start to have legit, like reasoning to go after Activision, I'll be right there supporting. But I'm just hoping that if and when Microsoft takes over, they will actually take over the customer support. So since that is happening, like I'm saying, like maybe just bide the time. I'm not telling people, listen, I'm not telling you don't take all the actions you can, but what I'm telling you is that don't get over angry. Don't get over upset. Hopefully Microsoft will right Activision's wrongs when they take if and when they take over the company. But what do you guys think about this? Like I don't blame the person for actually going down there. Do you? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember, like, share, and subscribe. May God bless you all.